Hello everybody and welcome back to our cave adventure. We are here in our baby little bunker. In our little, we did some little stuff. cave. And yes, we did some stuff. We did some stuff. We did some off camera stuff. You may be noticing we that did. I'm now in full iron. I'm holding 62 pork. Uh, he has oh, a diamond I'm pickaxe. 62 pork as well. I have a diamond pickaxe. Don't worry though. Oh, and we also both have spy glasses. It looks like we've made a ton of progress. We actually haven't. We re we essentially just did a little bit of extra. Oh my god, yes. Let's do it. I see you. But yeah, we essentially just... just did an extra bit of mining and crafted a few things with materials we already had. Uh, and also I went onto the surface and killed just a thousand pigs. But I made sure there were none yep. there spawn. So I, the, we so... should still have food resources above. But also... Genocide achieved. Indeed, genocide achieved. A good thing. I went exploring on the surface and found nothing of interest apart from a shipwreck, which all, only had a treasure map and not much else. So, you guys didn't miss anything in that, which is good. Because if we go on a... Vi I, I didn't want to end up finding a village or something cool, because I want that to be when we're both on. Uh, but anyways, I just basically got rid of a bunch of tedious tasks and did a few things. I went strip mining, managed to get a whole six diamonds. Oh, damn. Um, and also... I did this strip mine to start, just a random one, and yeah. we, we decided yeah, strip on something. strip mine singular, because he just goes in one direction forever. <laughs> this is, the other strip mine wasn't like this. Th this was mainly exploratory, because this was, bit, yeah. this was the first so, thing I did after we stopped recording, and I found something that's pretty interesting. It's, it's slightly far away from our bunker, but I think almost every single person watching will agree that this is worthwhile. And you'll yeah, he found us a bigger it. cave. I found a bigger and much more visually interesting cave, and it's not this one. Don't worry, it's it's not this one. But although this one is nice, but I I basically I came out here and I saw this like lava and water stream with like ooh that looks really cool. Went exploring, started lighting it up, and then turned left and found this beautiful cave. And not only does it look nice from here. But look at how high up it goes. And a geode just above. Water streams in the middle. Lava falls. It's just amazing. So we, we ended up building a, t a pillar here. And never named started to build the first module of our base. We're going to be building it with birch wood. Which some of you might be like, ew, gross. But we think it's actually really nice in terms of the contrasting colours of the uh, of the cave stones. I can't remember what this is. What, what, what's, what's it called? Um, deep deep slate. slate. The deep slate stone. I think it I think it contrasts really nicely and Nevernamed does a really good job, even with just this small platform, so I'm pretty happy with this. Um yeah, and that's kinda where we, that's kinda where we sit. You've not actually missed that much. You've missed a lot of playtime. We've probably played like between the two of us, like five hours extra. Yes, we played a lot. But we achieved a little. Exactly, yeah. We basically got rid of the mundane tasks which aren't fun to watch, like strip mining and Welcome collecting to the Turtle obsidian. Channel. We and play food. a lot, but we achieve a little. <laughs> Pretty much. But yeah, so we, we, we basically got rid of a bunch of shitty tasks, and uh, now we can do more cave exploring. We can do more building. Building is actually going to be a, a way more primary thing in this series than it was in the previous. Because for one, it's going to be really fun to build something really interesting. I'm sure Nevernamed will be taking lead on doing the building because... Yeah, there's no way I'm has, trusting you with that. Like, honestly, based on just your Gungeon mods, you have a much better eye for design and art than I do. I am terrible at all of that. Um, I can, come up, I can no, come up with ideas, no, 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 but no, I cannot execute them. This is just me throwing shit at the wall and seeing what sticks. I didn't... <laughs> But the thing is, though, when you throw shit at the wall and see what sticks, your shit does stick and it smells nice. When I throw it, it's fucking diarrhea. <laughs> That's the difference. I hate, I hate you. I hate you. I hate, see, no, you, I'm not you, playing you hate, with you anymore. You hate it because it makes sense, don't you? That's why you hate it. <laughs> Begrudgingly admits it does. Ah, fuck. <laughs> Um, but anyways, anyway, yeah, that's where we sit. Uh, so I went and got obsidian, so today we can go into the nether if we'd like. I think uh, one thing we should do first, if you come with me once you're ready, uh, we're going to quickly go and do a little bit of caving, because I found a new cave that I think would be kind of fun to explore, and I think we should do okay. that. So I started my strip mine here. Um, oh, oh, yeah. Yep, here. I'm, I'm, I'm losing you in all your little groundhog <laughs> tunnels. 
Um, this is a, a, just a staircase down to minus 55, which is apparently one of the most optimal places to mine. And if we go this way, we can see all of the boreholes that I mined. This is where I found two diamonds. And then all of these, I went another like 100 blocks and found fucking nothing. But if we come this way, oh, I also... I thought this was the way No, that... no, no. No, no, no. I also found nothing. But this time, I was going to come back and do the... Right. I was going to come back and do the boreholes, um, but I ended up mining and then just finding a cave, so. Wait a minute, yeah, it, it is down here, isn't it? I'm getting confused, don't don't worry, don't worry. This, this only happened like two hours ago, like I, I, I was on recently. Uh, but yeah, I, I, found, I found a cave and I really didn't want to, uh... wait, no, something's wrong. Hmm. Um... Really? <laughs> wait a minute. It's down, uh, is it down this way? Yeah, it's down this way, it's down this way. You're, you're, you're like a tourist in Paris. <laughs> There's a staircase somewhere. Is it here? Oh, this might be it. You take a right turn at the Eiffel Tower, you can't miss it. I'm not gonna lie. I may have lost the cave. <laughs> I can't Fuck remember where it hell. is. I'm going to beat you to death with my shovel. Where the fuck is it? <laughs> oh, shit! Find that cave, boy! I'm going to- Ow! 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 Right, let, let me- Let me go this way so you can find it. No, I'm so scared. I'm running away. Yeah, I, I'm genuinely a bit confused because I did find a cave, I promise you. I'm not lying. Yes, Turtle, you're always a bit confused. But yeah, as you can see, I did quite a lot of mining and got virtually fucking nothing. Like, I think overall, the I actually got more obsidian, which was 12, than any other ore. Uh, obsidian's not an ore. Well, yeah, but what I mean is I got 12 blocks of obsidian, but I didn't get 12 of any ore. Yeah, so... Mr. Melon. Oh, um... th this is it, this is it. Oh, good. Now we won't be able to find our way back. Okay, okay, so this is something. It starts off here. I'll just make sure this is covered so we don't end up dying. Turtle, <laughs> fucking, just don't fall in it. It's a big, obvious lava pit in the middle of open space. Shh, 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 shh. I will fall Oh, no, in. yeah, to, to be fair, yeah, you would fall in that. I am gonna say, you know, I almost just fell in a one-by-one one block of lava, to be honest, so... That's kind of what we're dealing with here. Yeah, it's like how you treat me like a wizard when I just run through the basalt <laughs> delta. Oh my god, yeah, that was amazing. That was like parkour to me. But as you can see, I did a tiny bit of exploration here, but I didn't go much further than this. Uh, I found a few surface level diamonds. But then I kind of stopped because I wanted to savor the, savor the exploration with you guys. And never knew it. I thought it'd be fun. Probably find some better ores, and hopefully, hopefully we can find some more diamonds because we do desperately need quite a few more. Um, one thing that I'm not sure about a new. Um... Hey, you know what you were talking about? What? Uh, you know, uh, diamonds. Oh, where are you? I've I've lost you completely. <laughs> you know that's the way I like it. Um, okay, one diamond. I think I just found a single diamond on its own. <laughs> One, eh, eh, eh. That's it. Eh, 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 eh. One Where diamond. Did you go? I've completely lost you. Where? I don't know where you are either. Are you, are you near the lava? I'm. I'm in the main cave. I'm in the open. I'm jumping up and down. What? Oh, there you are. I see you now. It's all the main cave. Ah! Terrible. Uh, by the Terrible. way, yeah, I was just I was just about to say, oh, spyglass, I see you, I see you. Oh, I just lobbed on my torches. <laughs> um, but what I was going to say is the a new snapshot came out since the last time we played and the server has updated. So do you reckon enchanting's fixed? Uh, I hope so. Because one of the problems we had when starting with the series and the, de the debate, we kind of, a very short debate, but the debate we had between doing caves update and doing normal was enchanting was cur was currently broken and might still be, we're not sure. Um, yeah, and yeah we're all our debate's like, hmm. pretty short because we can't stand each other. 
<laughs> exactly. It it just it just broke out into an all out fight, and then we stopped talking to each other for eighteen days. Yeah, I, I broke his fucking teeth. <laughs> Ooh, I found Anyways, a little holy serious. hole. I found one too. What, what the? How did you get through there without? Oh, I see where you are. What? I, I I saw your name through the wall, but I didn't see the entrance you came through. All I saw was a gap um, above you, and I was like, how did you get up there without using any blocks? Magic. Hey, oh, this uh, is cool. Do you shall think I do, you'd shall die, I do, shall I die shall... if I fell from the site? Why not just use that? Right, you go first. I need the water back, though. Yay, I went first. Is there danger? Um... Do you know what the biggest danger is? Getting lost. Yep. <laughs> also, as I said earlier to you just before the recording, no mobs. At all. Anywhere. Like, what's that about? It's so strange. It Did you make sure the server... I have, He's not yeah. I, ch I checked. I like. I I was so. Con oh, I found some diamonds. I was so concerned I about. Found them you first. Just, I didn't realize you just ran past them. <laughs> I was just letting another up the single cave. diamond. Really, another single yeah. diamond. That's two diamonds for me. Yeah. Apparently, one of the things they did with the uh, latest ore generation changes is changed how common surface level diamonds are. So we probably won't find many yeah. via those means. Yeah, you're more likely to find uh, diamonds that aren't adjacent to air. Uh, meaning that oh, you're more like in the top right, just peeking at us. That's, that's creepy. Where? Just, just up over this way. Also, oh, do you realize? Fuck, how I looked at him. I looked at him. Yeah, I was about oh. to fucking say. Do you realize how stupid of a statement it is? Oh, look at that Enderman. You know, you can deal with him. He's your problem. It's, it's lagging. I can't smack him. I might be dead. Oh no, I got him, I got him. Ho 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 ho. The game lagged real hard and I was like, oh no, am I going to be dead when this loads? <sighs> we can only hope. <laughs> um... Ah, <laughs> uh, this, this, um... This series has devolved into me thinking of the next <laughs> mean thing I can say. <laughs> what do you mean this series? You mean this friendship, I think is what you mean. Yes, the series of escalating tragedies. <laughs> Is that the title of your memoirs? A series of escalating tragedies. You know, it would be fitting. <laughs> oh, this is a nice cave, though. Oh, diamonds! We're not moving again. No, we're not, we're not. Our, our cave is better than this. Our cave's taller. Yeah, you know, our cave is tall, dark, and handsome. I'm gonna say. <laughs> and a fortune teller told cave. me I'd find out from a tall, dark, and handsome cave. This cave is like five foot two. Who even cares? Is that one hit a little bit too close to home, Turtle? Nah, I'm 5'8", I think 5'8". I'm, sh I'm short, but not like very, very short. <laughs> um... Give me those there's so beans. much lava, and I'm just know, jumping those, those through it lot. to prove a point. I'm gonna say, we're waiting until we see Crispy Never Named appear in the chat. Never name Gin Little Queespy. Uh, you do Find a mine shop. Ooh. Re uh, the, the statement I was about to say, I completely rescind. Whereabouts are you? Um, I'm, I'm not quite sure where I am. I'm just going to follow the torches. That's got to be you. Got to be a good way to lead towards you. I've put torches a lot of places. Yeah, I'm noticing that now. What's They're the kind of random. It's okay, I didn't fall into lava, I just fell into regular fire. Nice. I, I found something pretty cool. Um, This mineshaft generated over top of lava. Oh, I see it. So <laughs> I just look it, up and I see it all. And it burned the section that I'm hopping in through. <laughs> so I'm like on a natural burned bridge. Oh, I just heard you place a torch, I'm definitely gonna die. That's kind of cool that I looked up and there's just this beautiful mine shaft like above. Right, it looks so nice. I, love I, found this. I found a mob! 
Daniel, I found a mob! Where? Is it a single mob or is it a creeper? Oh, it is a creeper. Hello. The game has now decided to lag real bad. <laughs> that wasn't fear, Turtle. That was excitement. What is going on here? The game has just lagged so bad right now. Yeah, I, I might have accidentally pushed the lag the game so Turtle Melon dies switch. I'm sorry. There's a good chance I might. Like, there's now Ooh. mobs around me. I'm, I can see it. I can see it. I, I'm feeling it now, Mr. Krabs! <laughs> this creeper. Oh my god, there's creepers all around me. And the game yeah, is lagged so very that. hard. I just got uh, attacked by a cave spider. Oh no. I might need to disconnect and reconnect, you know, because, like, my game is, n like, none of the extra chunks are loading. I can see you moving around, but none of the mobs are moving. Yeah, well, oh, that's fucking cave spider. Okay, this, this, is, this is very strange, because I can eat and everything. I'm going to come over towards you and see, see, what, see what happens. We are so unbelievably lost now. No, Great. Don't bring your lag to me, you fucking heathen. I hate spreading. I, yeah, I absolutely love the idea so. of the chains that they've added to the uh, mine shafts. They look so nice. I think I just found some more diamonds as well. I'm going to go have a little look. Soon. You can keep your bloody lag to yourself. Also, I'm all out of torches. Nice. Not bird well for us. Oh my god, Ooh, this cave is amazing. Just a second. I think just that one creeper was glitched out, actually. I found a potato! I found myself a potato. Fuck, the diamonds I thought I saw were just some more of that shitty grass. What are you saying? Wait a second, Dad. What have you found? Uh, no, that wasn't me saying that I found something. That was me saying that somebody wanted to talk to me. Ah. Um... <laughs> Yes, um, anyways, yeah, glow lichen. It's fucking glow lichen! It's I can just... use that as a light source! Yeah, I've got shears on me at all times now to take glow lichen whenever I find it. The only thing is you know, glow lichen doesn't really stand out in caves anymore, so it's, it's hard as you use it to find your way back. I don't really care about finding my way back at this point. We know we're lost. That's true. Might as well just commit. I just care about being able to see where I'm going. Not see where I've been. This cave is awesome. Turtle, we're not cheating we're on not, our cave again. We're not moving. We're not moving. We're committed to the cave we have. But, I do have to say, this cave is thick. Yeah. You make me uncomfortable with some of the things you say. Yeah, I know. I make myself uncomfortable with things I say. Do you have any coal, perchance, governor? No, I do not. Of course you don't. There are going to be people who think I actually fucking despise you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hoping that the amount of videos we've done with each other by now should hopefully indicate that we're not friends. Okay, I, re I returned to that, like, chunk with the, uh... The creeper, it's still you know, there. I can yeah, see the you through the wall, there's an, un there's an unloaded chunk, so I can see you through the wall. And I can see a horse on the surface as well. Fancy. Extra sensory perception. Indeed. Someone outside, outside being extremely loud right now. I open my window for some fresh air and I've got to listen to a fucking argument. Thanks. Yeah, why not just listen to the argument that's happening right here? <laughs> I did find some more uh, iron, though. We do need more iron. We are very low on iron. Oh, It's kind of it's kind of crazy how, like, the cave update has actually made it harder to get ore because you spend more time exploring surface level caves than strip mining. Like a lot more time. 
Yeah, I suppose that makes sense. If you're a fucking idiot. Ah, uh, that was too mean. I'm sorry. No, it's not. Cry. When, I, when, when we finish this call, I'll just cry. Good weep. Weep. A good weep. Weep! <laughs> oh my god. But yeah, I am, I am like truly, truly fucking gone right now. I have like absolutely zoomed away. I am miles away from the base. I just, I'm, I'm desperate to find more diamonds. We, we, we need more. We, we need to start getting diamond armor if we want to go to the, uh, the nether, really. I mean, we don't need it, but it'd be really nice to have. And this fucking glow like in it looks so much like diamonds from a distance. It's so frustrating. And I've just been placing it everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> it is really cool for, for a light source, though, and we should definitely use more of it on the base. So on the one hand, we found where all the mobs are. On the other hand, the mobs haven't found where all the mobs are. <laughs> oh, shit. Also, the glow like in... No, 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 I just fell off something. The glow like in is kind of deceptive because you're like, oh, a light source, that means there's lava nearby, and it's not. <laughs> are you alive, Mr. Zombie? Are you alive, boy? Uh, yeah, I found a living zombie. Oh, that doesn't make sense. Um, I found a an animate zombie. I found a mob mm -hmm. that is mob. Oh, I found a mob spawner. <laughs> yeah, there just seems to be something about that chunk. Ooh, I got, a music, just... I got a music disc, but really not much else. Some coal and hey, some bones. Music discs are fancy. It's can... um, 13. Yeah, you said you. Oh, we can use some of those two diamonds we found. We can. And we can play tunes. We can absolutely bop. We can play some of those tunes. Yeah, Margaret. We can absolutely bop if we want to. Right. Now I need to just try and remember how I got into this mess. And by that I mean how did playing you Minecraft here? with you. <laughs> um, right. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty lost right now. Hmm, yes, how did we get into this mess? I think you approached me going, Please, Mr. Nivenid, please give me but a crumb of thine clout. <laughs> <laughs> Now I was like, dude, I saw your, I saw your egg stream. I, I must have more. <laughs> you know, I don't remember how we met. Um, neither do I actually. Um, this was a legitimate oh, question. How did oh, we meet? Where I, I, am I? I? I remember now. You, um, you released. You, you were working on your room pack, and I'd previously been working on expand the dungeon, um, on rooms, and I just for so I was already in your server, and I have been for a while. And I can't remember why, like, I can't remember how this initiated, but it ended up that I joined a voice call, and then you joined, and I ended up testing your rooms with you, and you watched me play them. And then we ended yeah, up talking yeah. after that. I don't know how we I got won't to that lie. point, but... You know, I won't lie, um, I did know about you before that point. I had seen your YouTube videos. I, I never watched them. I just didn't care. <laughs> Yeah, I just didn't care. To be frank, my thoughts were rolling the lines of who the fuck is this little shit? <laughs> um, I'm gonna speak to him, he'll steal my clout. Like, the, I was I was at my peak of like, I am Gungo Man. Gungo. <laughs> really who the this fuck is... does this little <laughs> shit think he is making Gungeon informational videos? <laughs> I rule this land I'm gonna, I'm gonna break his fucking neck. I well, don't yeah, know I why say, I felt I, <laughs> I I suspect that pretty much any content creator in the Gungeon community, whether they've spoken to me or not, probably knows who I am by now. I'm pretty active in most Gungeon aspects, and I've been yes, posting for like two and a half years. You're pervasive. We can't get rid of you. Exactly. I'm like a disease. Yes. The real virus was the friends we made along the way. <laughs> I'm I'm completely lost because I'm like 
There's a there's an unloaded chunk near this um near this mine shaft that I can't get past, and I don't know how to get back to the mine shaft. Don't worry, I'm lost too. <laughs> like I genuinely don't know how to get out of this cave. I'm so lost. Like I figured that I'd like go exploring and then I, I, we'd figure out step two when we came to that. Hey, this is just part of the adventure. It's it's fun. Yeah, you not know, part of the adventure thing. is not knowing where the hell you are, and then having to buy a map from like a shady merchant. <laughs> uh, Let's try up here. I'm just taking various water streams. Ooh, thunder! What the fuck? Why can I hear? There's probably a storm on the surface. Oh my god! I didn't know you could hear it this low down. Well, Not what's like, your wire elevation? I was at like um, minus three or four. I'm like ninety percent sure that like the sound of thunder is global. That you can hear it from wherever you are. Ah, interesting. Yeah, because I remember something about that being used. I uh, know. Uh, you know the trope. About that being used on the oldest anarchy server in Minecraft. Minecraft. I love his videos. That's so good. I watch his videos all the time. Well, I say it all the time. Yeah. Whenever they come out. For some reason, bald people make for good YouTubers. They do. That is why next week I'm shaving my head. <laughs> for the content, guys. For the content. Turtle melon face reveal and face removal. <laughs> I found a random ravine. I have not. Yeah. But I have, however, found a massive cave. That's good. I'm gonna like, take up all the ore that I can get at the minute. Have you found a new massive cave? Is it beautiful? Yes. Do I need to see it? Uh, it is quite pretty, yes. Damn. I feel like I'm missing that out. Mm. Meanwhile, I'm just but looking it's... at this ugly old stone texture because I'm too high up. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, no, it's, a, it's, I'm actually, this is in the positive elevation, so this, it is a stone cave. Someone's calling. No worries. Oh, wait, shit. I can't pause the game. I'm in the middle of a skeleton fight. Just, just disconnect. Ah! Just disconnect. Kill it and disconnect. No, no, I'm just going to resort to the solution of putting myself in a little box. Just a second. No worries. Ah, oh, fuck off, skeleton. Needy little shithead. Oh, really? This game likes the worst possible times sometimes. There's three of them! I'm so dead. I'm back. I'm gonna die. It all happened so fast. It all happened so fast. They Holy shit. It's just, I just, I jumped off something into a water stream and there's three skeletons at the base of the water stream and I start climbing up it and they all shoot me out of the water stream. Oh, three skeletons. That sounds like where I just was. Yeah. Scurry. I don't like it. So, we did find the mobs. We did, yeah. They were they were absent for a little while, but they came back in full force. They really did. They they, they, they gave absolutely... They had us in the first half, not gonna lay. Yeah, pretty much. Right, skeletons. How many of, the, of you left? Okay, I actually managed to kill them all. Okay, nice. At first, I was afraid. Good on ye, lad. I was petrified. I just, I love how in this game, in this update, you can just find, like, you're, you're, you're stumbling around and you just find a drop that takes you from, like, Y15 to, like, minus 50. It's great. It's dangerous I mean, as hell. unless you fall down it. Yeah, I gotta say, I was actually, um, I, was, I told you about this already, name name, but I was on the surface level, uh, messing around, and I found a one wide, three long gap that went from, like, Y100 and something, whatever I was at, because I was at kind of in a sort of hilly area, all the way to minus three. <laughs> it was very scary to just stumble across that and almost fall into it. Yeah, usually you'd only used to find things like that in the nether. Yeah, like, the dan dangers like that really weren't in. But the thing is, like, as, as crazy as, as that is, there is shit like that in real life where there's just fucking holes in the earth. Yeah, 
I know. I come from a country that's full of caves. Hot holes. Yeah, I come from like the Swiss cheese, cheese land. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, these skeleton arches, you can stop. You know, as opposed to those other skeletons in this game. Yeah, exactly. Those other skeletons are much worse. The wither. Yeah, I can safely assume you're fighting archers if you say skeletons. <laughs> Damn it, are those darn Nordic battle axe wielding <laughs> skeletons? I just found somewhere that's very flat. Strange. Stumbled into a super oh, flat world by I accident. I think, I think I found... Oh, maybe not. Just some lighting issue. I thought I found some infested rock, but it's just lighting issues. Yeah, I'm not sure why you'd be finding that unless it was like a stronghold or a mountain biome. No, no, in, in these you can find uh, infested rocks. It's like a feature oh. of, the, of some of these caves. They just have them sometimes. They're pretty rare. I think they used to be like really common and they just lowered the... They lowered how common they were by quite a lot. But yeah, you, you can find them in here. My sword's about to break. Oh, damn. We should try and meet up again and, and like do something productive. Yeah, this is fun, but I wouldn't exactly say we're breaking new ground. <laughs> no. I mean, also, like, I am just so lost. There is, I am going to have to use the coordinates to get back home. Oh, shit. Oh, shitty shit. Ah! ah! Don't, please don't die. You're so far away from home. I almost got that yeeted off the good. edge of a cliff by a zombie. Yeah, that's another danger. There's such sheer cliffs that, yeah, you can get pushed off pretty easily. Okay, what are the coordinates that I should be heading towards? Uh, just, just just go to the ones that I sent you in the Discord. Uh, obviously, it'll be a few messages back now. Oh, I don't... I, th I think it's, I think it's like... It's like 429, 480 or something like that. So something along those lines. It's like 400, 400 oh. positive. That, that's about right. It won't be exact, but that's pretty close. Ooh, I found a really cool flooded cave here. A really cool slug cave? Flooded. Not slug cave. Where are you going to slug? Oh, this is a really cool flooded cave. See, every time you say flooded, you fumble your words and it sounds like you're saying slug. What? Does, <laughs> does it? I never, no, never noticed that before. Flooded. There's a really cool slug cave. There's a really cool slug cave here. Honestly, where are all the diamonds? Where is the keeper? Oh my god. There's a little meeting. There's there's three skeletons and a witch all just gathered around each other. Nope, don't shoot Coven. Me. I know, I'm going to say, yeah. Coven of the witches, goddamn. Step away from that witch bitch. There's some salmon in here. Nice. You know what they say, the natural size of a coven is one. Just one witch. Yeah, they can't stand each other. I can't imagine they got on too well, to be fair. I'm saying this like they're fact. Like they're fact. Which is... Uh, every time you open your mouth, you say something strange. <laughs> I do. I, I aim to have a certain amount of strange per minute in, my, in what I say. I've got a quarter each day. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. It okay. Shows. Okay. Wait, what, what am I doing? I'm going the wrong direction. Been mining in the wrong bloody direction. I'm still banking on finding diamonds. <laughs> like, I haven't started coming home yet. I need to. Oh, I see your name. Where? I'm like above you, um, and I think behind you. <gasps> Lava, don't, don't step in that. Have you been here? Yes, you have. You've been here. There's torches. This is the cave that you were talking about, I think. I think I'm in that cave you were talking about. Just come towards my name. I've lost it again. It's gone. Oh, nope, it's back. It's back. Oh shit, that's a sheer drop and I jumped off. What the hell am I doing in my life? Are you okay? 
Yeah, but not mentally. Oh wait, I see. I I see our name. Well, I see a turtle melon off in the distance. We found each other. Yeah. Where the hell are you going? Together forever, the world seems fine. I never would ever Hello. leave you behind. Yay! Let's make our way home somehow. Alrighty. Right. I have a ton of lapis. So we need to head this way. A ton of lapis. Also, um, there. how much obsidian did you grab again? Twelve. Twelve. Is that enough to make a portal? Yeah, I think so. False part, wasn't it? I thought it was fourteen. If you cut off the corners, I think it's twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, it is twelve. Yeah. I don't know why I thought it was fourteen. And then I didn't get any for enchanting because I didn't know if we could. <laughs> so I was like, why bother? And it took. Yeah, so uh, long I was about to, to say we like, need mm. we need more obsidian. Excuse me, little skelly bob. What do you think you are doing? Got him. I was trying to shoot the skeleton and be cool. Well, you can. I know I can't, but I can dream. Right, uh... We gotta keep going this way. Um, we can probably make it back through the mine shaft, right? Kind of, I think. Just, just, just go in the direction that we go. Okay. You've got to dig there. Let's we tandem, will let's all let's go dig together again. when we go. Every hot and dot and every Eskimo. There will be no more misery when the world is our rotisserie. Yes, we all will go together when we go. Gravel. That scared me. That's a lot of gravel. At least we got some flint. I wonder when we need that. We will all fry together when we fry. Hey! <laughs> To break my torches. You know not to place to <laughs> torches there. We've been over there. And now I can't mine through your fat head. I have a thick skull. Don't judge me. Goddamn gravel. Why is it? Why does it exist? What why level are we at at the moment? Eleven. Okay. Oh, I keep forgetting. Sorry. When you attend a funeral, it is sad to think that sooner or later those you love will do the same for you. And you may have thought it tragic, <laughs> not to mention other adjectives, to think of all the weeping they will do. But don't you worry. I am going to get DMC I'm here, Jim. <laughs> now an armband made of black cloth will one day never more adorn a sleeve. For if the bomb that drops on you gets your friends and neighbors too, there'll be nobody left behind to grieve, and we will all go together I when we go. I guarantee you're the only person that knows this song. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. That's why you won't get DMCA, because DMCA doesn't know that it exists. <laughs> I'm so hipster, DMCA doesn't even know. It's not hipsterism, it's liking good music. Um, right. Oh, okay, so this, this cave should kind of take it in the right way. As long as these if I can remember, fucking I can kill me. Are we still alive? You know, I'd be, I'd be really useful in this fight if I could. Ow. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'd be really useful if I could hit something and you hit me. I okay. I mean, that was a hit. That counts, kind of. <laughs> it does count. Yes. And remain. Right, how close are we? We're... Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. We're almost home-ish. 
I think we can make it if we come down here. There's some there's some creepies down here, but we can kind of shortcut through here. Come on. Okay. 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 No, get out of my fucking hole! I'm killing the Enderman. Oh. Uh. You can't hit me if I'm in a, a small hole. It's like the strategy. I'm excited to see how the uh, how the warden's going to be because they said that he's really hard to cheese, like a lot of the mobs in vanilla Minecraft at the minute. I'm kind of excited to see how uh, how they're going to make him hard to cheese. But I like cheese because literally just going on top of a pillar or digging yourself into a wall works for any mob in the game at the moment. Warden will be able to climb and dig. I mean, actually, it's quite possible that he might be able to dig, yeah. I killed the creeper. Yay. Proud of me? I am. Get on down here, boy. Take some of this iron. We do need iron. Yes, sir. You've been ignoring every fucking iron deposit we've walked past, and I just have been doing the same because I figured you didn't want them. Eh. I just couldn't be asked. But now I can. Why is there so many skeletons? Oh, dude, there's Sorry. a massive fucking... Oh, that was very close. <laughs> it's a pit there. Sorry. <laughs> I was trying to go for the skeleton. You're not very good at hitting the enemy, are you? Or am I your enemy? No. <laughs> I mean, you know. Also, the, yeah, the uh, changes to ore generation, how it's, like, you know, less likely for ores to spawn exposed to air. Yeah. Mean that flooded caves are more uh, useful. Yes, indeed they are. Because the water um, doesn't count as air. Doesn't, uh, air. Very useful, yeah. And the, the, honestly, the flooded caves are relatively common from what we've seen so far. Yeah. Where are you? Oh, you gone. I just went under just to demonstrate my point. Yeah. Very Ooh. blue down here. Dabba D. I'm blue, Dabba D, Dabba Die. Who is Dabba Die? Ooh, there's some flowers over here. It's probably a mine shaft. Well, how does that work out in your brain? Normally, you get those little square rooms with the with the dirt and the flowers in them. I thought it was one of them. Does this not? Does this look like a square room, Tattle? It does not. Oh damn! This area, this area has not much air. Careful. But where did you go? I went under the rocks. I'm coming back. Look, We're gonna have to send here. Elon Musk in a fucking child <laughs> coffin submarine to get you out. <laughs> Come on, go under, dive, and up. Are you ready? Up, oh, and we go again. Oh, I found some air. <laughs> Hello there. <laughs> I've become a little snake. No! I mean, at least now I can mine one block wide hole to get home. I'd have to mine as no. much. No! No! Oh, we're, we're at 470, 470. I think we just need to go down and then we'll find home. Now, how do I get in there myself? Yeah, dig straight down. Yes, no, I'm doing. Don't look at you. Well done. Hey! Hi. Hello. Ba -ba 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 -da. I just I find it so funny that you can just oh fuck it out. I felt like that. You just gonna fold your body up into a thingy. We are so gonna fucking both die here. One minute. I I want to make sure we're not on the same we're not on the same one, so we don't both fall you into lava at the exact same time. If, we, if if you're to be trusted, then we're near home. We are somewhere near so, him. Yeah, but remember, our home has lava in it. What if we just dig down into one of the lava things? I'm back. Do you know what? Fucking perfect, right? That's pretty good, that. Yeah, I know. I know. I, it was almost as if there was nothing to be afraid of. Like, no, but no, but what I'm saying is, imagine if we digged over a few blocks over and we'd gone straight under this and missed it. Like, this is perfect. Yeah, We're right on the wall. Yeah, imagine, you know, if we digged over it. Digged over it. Yeah, exactly. Imagine that. Digged over it. Right. Come on now, boy. Let's go. You are from the UK. You should be able to speak English. But Bobby, you speak English. 
I love that line. <laughs> Speak the Queen's English. No. Okay, where's the tunnel to the new cave? I Over keep here. on losing it. Yeah, it's pretty well blended in. Yeah, because it's stone against more stone. <laughs> Let's go. I can hear us both just spamming spears bar. <laughs> Vigorously spam it. Go with this, this. And I ran out of hunger. Oh, all of it. <laughs> oh, you're down to oh. three bars, so you can't sprint. <laughs> Another time. Fucking Windows update. It's like Windows needs to update. Uh, would you like to do that right, right freaking now? <laughs> no. No, I wouldn't, Windows. Can you go stuff a giant stick up your ass? Ah, oh, herb sweet herb. Right, sir. We've got a few options. Do we want to go do above ground exploration, finding villages and stuff? Do we want to go to the Nether, or do we want to build? I want to do building, but building requires above ground exploration because we need wood. Yes, we do. So I think we go above ground. Cool, sounds good. Uh, let's um, let's melt up all of this, smelt up even all of this iron. Um, I actually have a lot more iron than I thought. Right. Uh, Kind of running out of space in here. Maybe we'll, I'll, I'll bring the buried treasure map. We can go and chase that. Oh, yeah, that'll be good. Um, I'm going to set out the framework for, like... I have enough... We have enough birch that I can do some more scaffolding. Some nice. more, like, uh, framework. Yeah. Uh, for the arrow, base. And I wanna... You've got a bow. Oh, yes, 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 please. Yep. I am the bowman. Bowman. I speak for the bows. And I'd like uh, to say a few words to your toes. I'm like, I, I was just thinking, how the fuck did I get raw chicken? But I remember there was a uh, baby, baby zombie riding a chicken down there. Keep that flint. I am the bowman. I speak well, for I've the Well, I've actually bowman. got a, I've actually got an almost full durability bow as well. I, I say nothing without extensive pros. I tossed a bunch of stuff in the garbage. Okay, uh, shit. This pillar is gonna get in the way. So we, we want to do hanging, we, we decided we're gonna do like hanging platforms. Yeah, so essentially one of the sort of design ideas that we have is it's gonna be kind of modules like this this thing that Nevername has built here, similar to this, um, but we're gonna have them sort of in an Ewok village style where they're gonna be really small, thin sort of arching pathways between them. And they're probably going to be suspended by chains or propped up by natural pillars. Um, and we're just going to have different rooms. I think like the amethyst room, because we've got a bunch of amethyst blocks, will end up turn turning into like the enchantment room, because that would be quite cool. Yeah, yeah. And then like these plus, lava spouts nice will turn to be, like a forge and stuff like that. It's nice to be so close to a geode, because when Mojang eventually adds an actual fucking use for amethyst, uh, we'll be able to farm it. Yeah, we will, yeah. Really nice, because it regrows, doesn't it? Yeah. Um, so long as you don't break the budding blocks. So. Once all this iron's done, I'm going to bring some... Uh... Actually, I'll get the sticks now. Okay, so if bring I do this... Half of it. Got that wood. Okay, good. Uh, and then I'm just going to bring some iron so we can make tools on the go. Wait, no, this isn't going to work. Oh, dear. So, yeah, so as you can see, Nevenem's kind of making this little platform now. We don't want to ugly the cave too much. We really want to keep the natural structure, and we don't want to We don't want to have these modules fucking everywhere. We want to be able to see between them and see up and stuff. And I think one one really good thing that we should try and make sure they do, and I'm, I'm sure you agree, is make sure they're very varying heights. Yeah. Yeah. We don't want them all to be on the same Y level, because it'll just look kind of odd. And 
yeah, it's, it's kind of it's kind of difficult as to how they'll each look, but I think it's going to be kind of more be themed. This is going to be the general layout of what they look like as a base level, but then they'll each be themed on top of that. And like I said, Never Named will probably take charge on most of that. I'll help with the building yeah. where I can, but a lot of the time I'll just be laying foundations for Never Named to be creative because he's much better at that than I am. But yeah, so as soon as this stuff's ready, we can go on a little adventure. Okay, so I think I've developed a prototype for the pathway. Using slabs to give it a sort of bend. Yeah, they give it that little sort of weird arch that we're thinking of. Uh, how do we make chains? Ah! Like the ones that, uh, that are on mineshafts. I'm, gu I'm guessing it's iron and something else, but I don't know what the other thing is. Let me look it up. I'm, I'm guessing it's something to do with iron nuggets. Possibly, yeah. Yeah, uh, you need iron nuggets. Man, remember when iron nuggets were added and they were, like, cool? <laughs> and now it's like, what do you even use those things for? Uh, it's, it's like... Uh, an iron nugget on the top and bottom, and an iron ingot in the middle to make a chain. Okay. But yes, um, we still need wood to do, like, the borders and the main structure of the things. And I know that including stone in the designs is, like, kind of weird, because why? But, uh, it'll make sense someday, probably, maybe. No, no. Um... So, so let's, uh, yeah. let's head up to the surface. I've got 40 food, I've got the treasure map, I've got shears, I've got a water bucket, I've got some wood, some sticks, tools, I've brought some extra iron as well in case we need to make more tools. So we I'm just sort of building set. the structure for a sort of middle Get in bed. module. No, turtle. Consent is important. Get in bed now, bitch. Four, five. Consent, turtle. Anyways, what's this? What's this shit? Having our beds apart? What am I? Yeah. Fun. Get him. <laughs> <laughs> bro, you don't want to. You don't want to sleep with me, bro. It's kind of <laughs> gay. Oh, no, I threw my pickaxe. Give it back. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't grab it. You got it. Right out. Let's go. I By see a way, diamond pickaxe in your hand. You stole it. I didn't do these stairs that far right. I need to put... I need to put... Um, Yeah, good, because they're inconvenient as shit. They just look um, nice. Wouldn't you agree? No, they, no, they don't. They look nice in the dish. Put some of the stuff in my inventory away. Anyways, this 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 isn't permanent because we're gonna make water spires as soon as we go to the Nether. Because I've already got some of the um the red the magma cubes, magma blocks, whatever they're called. Magma magma blocks. Yes, thank you. Um and yeah, all we need is soul sand. So if we spawn in like a valley or something, we're pretty set to go. I mean, we only we only need one, don't we? Like they have infinite height, don't they? I think. Uh yeah, they just need a, they need a solid source, stream of water. They? Yeah, it needs to be source. Yeah, so they, uh, we need to we need get help. help. Uh, anyways, where do, where are you? I'm on the stairs. Just come, coming up the top. Yeah, so we'll need kelp if we want to do it easily. Yeah, uh, we'll, we're going to try and get this buried treasure if it's not too far away, so we can get kelp then. I'm guessing kelp's pretty common. Yeah, it's too common, if you ask me. Um, you're on kelp collection duty. Cool. I'll get the kelp. Also, this staircase isn't final. I hope you know that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> definitely not. <laughs> definitely not. I'm going to work on building a nice-looking staircase. Because, I'm going to say, the staircase is just kind of going to be visual, and then we'll mainly just use the water streams. But it's just nice to have one, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. This will probably remain until we get the water streams. Yeah, and sadly, the one downside of this base compared to the last one is this one doesn't out into a cave of its own, which was really cool. Yeah, I, I was excited for the idea. I was excited for the idea of the annex, but we could still build an above ground section if we wanted. How the fuck do you okay. read these things? 
Give me the map. <laughs> I have no idea where the fuck I am. No wonder you were holding it upside down. Okay, so <laughs> to hit it is to the north east, northwest. So we need to head north. Northwest Philadelphia. There's a floating plant here. I don't care. So, do we want mainly birch, or are we getting oak and birch? Uh, oak and birch, because oak is for the surroundings. Okay. We don't need to grab, grab we'll, that yet, though, do we? We'll do that on the way back. I'm going to say, yeah. There's, there's plenty of oak and birch around our spawn. The thing about that cave, though, is, is like we don't need to do a lot of beautifying, because it's no, already we don't. so beautiful. Exa that is one of the best things about the cave update and cave bases. Like... You, your surroundings, you don't need to terraform at all, as long as you find a nice cave. Hey, look, Dark Oak. Yeah, I found this out uh, when I was going around. You'll, you'll be, be able to tell what, where I've been, because the chunks will be loaded. Well, they, they, won't, be, they won't be fully loaded, but they'll be, they'll, they won't lag when you load them in. That's what I noticed, like, the chunks that, you go, that you've been to before. They still have to load, obviously, but they don't lag. Look at this! Shit. Look at this lake! Oh, that's so nice. They're so, so much better, aren't they? So much better. Yeah. Like, the cave ups update accidentally was also a lake update. Yeah. I, I gotta say, it's just made terrain generation from top to tail when the mountains get added, at least. Like, so much better. I haven't heard someone say top to tail in years who wasn't a furry. Where have you gone? And I don't, How... I'm heading north. Oh, there you are. I don't think I've heard someone say top to tail in years who wasn't a furry. And I don't think they were saying it like you were. No. The last time I heard it said by someone else was some, someone referring to when two people sleep in a bed and one person is laying on it normally and the other person is laying with their head at the other side. Kinky. <laughs> um, the 69 of yeah. sleepovers. Yes. Exactly. Platonic <laughs> um, The kid-friendly, parent-approved version. Don't bring kids into it, no. you fucking weirdo. <laughs> okay. Oh, look, we found the black sheep of the family. <laughs> I, like, I like the fact that bo we both were like, immediately like, kill it. <laughs> kill it and kill its child. <laughs> Oh god, this is social commentary. Um, Turtle Melon confirmed racist. Yeah, pretty much. One thing that's kind of annoying with like how slow the chunks load on this server uh, is that you get to the edge and you like you see water and you're like ah I'm at the sea and then it loads and you're like ah it's just a really small pond. I mean, I could tell it wasn't the sea by the fact that they were you know lily pads. I just see this. This isn't yeah. even the sea. It's so speedy, boy. Yeah, I know how to navigate the terrain. Oh, we've gone past it. We need to go back. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> I know how to navigate. Oops. <laughs> but we, we haven't gone past it by much. Cool. I, I just hadn't glanced at my map for a second there, okay? Okay. Yeah, who's the one who couldn't even read the map at all? Who's the one who can't even read? It's me. <laughs> okay. Okay. This is the, the around the level, and now we need to head west. Cool. Yeah, anyone that actively watches my Darkest Dungeon series knows that I can't read. There are so many beautifully written backstories and diary entries that I just butcher. <laughs> I love it when you, so when you can see animals spawn in an unloaded chunk, and they just spin rapidly. It's hilarious. I'm gonna grab some sugar cane and sand. We can build a farm I found layer. Kelp. I found a kelp. Do I need shears to kelp or, to get the kelp or not? Uh, no, you don't. My Minecraft is lagging, so all I'm seeing is he's standing there while you say, "I got the kelp." Ah, there's a little. Ah, oh, what? Fuck oh, yeah! I'm gonna say yeah. I, I. What even just happened then? I'm gonna kill this little. Fishy boy. I'm very scared of this lag because there's a puffer fish here. Oh, 
I have been ruined by modern meme culture. Modern meme culture, why? I laugh at Amogus. Yeah, I hate Amogus. I'm sorry to say it. But no, no Turtle Mill and Amogus videos. No, I'm sorry, but I do not like the meme. I have a very good friend in Rome named Sussus Amogus. <laughs> that, that, however, I do like. I love that video. <laughs> oh god, it's so good. I will not have my friends ridiculed by the common soldiery. What's wrong with it? What's wrong with it? Biggest dickus? What's wrong with the name? Bigus Dickus. What's your joke name, sir? I have a good friend in Rome named Bigus Dickus. He has a wife, you know. <laughs> What's wrong with the name Turtle Mewen? What's your joke name, sir? <laughs> I have a good friend in Rome named Turtle Mewen. <laughs> yeah, that will never get old for me. I gotta say, it is just an absolute classic. It's so good. Alright, when you're done, um, with the kelp, could you please... Yeah, yeah, I just- I, I need to get at least two stacks because of how high up we have to go. We can bone meal it! Oh, uh, can you? Okay, I did not know that. <laughs> it literally looks like I'm picking up, like, fucking dead cucumbers that are just floating in the water. Stop. <laughs> Dead cucumbers floating in the water. Yeah, that's gonna be the title of your biography. Okay, I got. I, I said I needed two stacks. I've got three. That that should do. All right, now get get over here, Mister Dead Pickles. <laughs> <laughs> what up, fool? Okay. We are close. The map is filling in. Oh god, the server is really not handling us loading this many chunks very well. It does not Just like keep swimming. You just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Oh gosh, you just swimming. keep like you just keep like stopping in the middle of the water and then like zooming forward really far. <laughs> Gotta go fast. Okay, it looks like we're gonna be approaching some sort of archipelago. Archipelago is that the word I'm looking for? I don't even know what that word is. So. Uh, we'll assume that it's the right word, and that I'm not, you know, losing my mind. Isle. Let's go Isle, because that's a word you should know. There it is. I see an Isle. I see Let us land. go and... Let us commence. Uh, we will make landfall, we will claim the island, and we will kill all the natives. And we will pillage and destroy. Yes, you're from the UK. You, you know how to do that, right? Exactly, yeah. It's in, it's in my blood. Yeah. God, what is this? We've just made ourselves sound like terrible people. More than we <laughs> usually do. Yeah. More than we usually do. Dogs! We've done a, uh, we've done a bit too much uh, pillaging. My god, you are lagging so bad right now. So am I. I do apologize for any of you watching. It is just as annoying for us. Ah, uh, don't worry. It evens out. The, the server doesn't stay like this. It, it does, like, sections of it. Let's be honest. How many of the people watching are actually watching and not just listening? That's to me true. saying, Sussus Amogus. <laughs> That's true. And like I, like I said at the end of the last episode, if anyone made it that far, we kind of just... We're, we're just playing this together because we want to. And we're recording it because we both have a YouTube channel. <laughs> That's kind of... <laughs> That's kind of it. Yeah, you know me making all my YouTube videos. Yeah, I know that you upload daily. Yeah, I'm on that YouTube grind. <laughs> okay. It should be at the tip of this island. Yay. Here, so it's somewhere on this beach. Start digging. Ah, uh, yes, hello, father. 
They never they never listen when you say you need quiet, do, <laughs> do they? I'm the one making loud noises. I'm the one who gets to make the loud noises. Just say Not you, me. Dad, I'm a Minecraft YouTuber now. What do you understand about that? Are you not proud of me? I'm a Minecraft you I need privacy to dig up the beat <laughs> with my friend who's a melon. My only friend is a fruit. <laughs> First one to find the chest wins. Hmm. This is this is truly a treasure hunt. I mean, it's a very close close range treasure hunt. Can it be under the stone? Does it have to be like buried under sand? I, I don't know. I found it. Yay! Over here. Oh, that's actually pretty good. That's a pretty yeah, good haul. Yeah, we went on a we went on an adventure for it. Of course, it's a pretty good haul. We got a heart of the sea. Should we, should we explore this island a little bit and get some wood from here? Yeah, sure. There's we a can bee. destroy this ecology. There's a bee. Go break the hive. Where? I don't want to. They'll be angry. Yeah, but well, that's the funny part. You know, it's funny when they're angry at you. Look, it's pigs. I haven't seen them in so long since I eradicated them from our island. <laughs> <laughs> the joke keeps on just writing itself. <laughs> I've British man you. travels. British man travels to new and exciting isle, loots and pillages. <laughs> I completely lost you again. Where have you gone? Oh, there you are. I'm, I barely left the beach. I'm just getting wood. It's just your name doesn't show up for some materials. It's like it through the through the leaves on trees. It just doesn't show up. You're not using those RTX shaders. To be fair, I was trying to install shaders only to realize that you can't use them on snapshots. But also, I, I found the most shaders. ominous flower garden. The most ominous flower garden. Yeah, yeah, this is this yeah, is the pigs that I was on about. It's quite cool, isn't it? Yeah, like look at this. You just have one flower looming in the darkness. Oh my god, yeah. Yeah, it's poisonous. I bet I'm it's keeping poisonous. this one. I'm naming him Humphrey, and we're keeping him. Nice. Well, Speaking of Humphrey, then? um. You know Neighborino's Frost and Gunfire, right? Yeah. And how I've been ruthlessly adding compatibility for my items with Frost and Gunfire and yeah. Planet Side of Gunny Meat? Yeah. Well, remember the Chaos Synergy with my Crucible that can make it re-roll into any enemy yeah. whatsoever? <laughs> I decided to make that include the... Uh, test enemies that Neighborino made. Oh, no. They're not actually that difficult, but it occasionally means you'll come across like a weird pale square named Humphrey. <laughs> That's kind of great. I love that. Yeah. Neighborino should, names all add, of his, um, like, in development enemies stupid stuff. You should add a synergy to the Crucible that can reroll them into Kevin's. <laughs> Just have multiple Kevins. This is it's getting dangerously terrible. close. Dangerously close to the podcast talk. We come here to escape, Gungeon. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I don't care. I come here to talk to you because I'm lonely. <laughs> Same. Well, not really. Same. Um. <laughs> yeah. Not in the same way, but same. I'm socially lonely. I'm not actually lonely. I'm both. Do I get a prize? <laughs> you can have a sticker. I get a gold star. Yeah. Um. On that side. But yeah, it's <laughs> it's it's hard not to talk about it because it's most of the stuff I've been doing oh, yeah, lately. Yeah. yeah. Well, to be fair, when are me and you not talking about Gungeon? It's like it's like ninety percent of what we interact about. <laughs> Yeah, and the other, like, 10% is me crying in your tears. Pretty much. That's all That's all we do. So I'm we allowed do. to make Dungeon a joke about cry. that. It's, the crying is sometimes about Gungeon. Sometimes the two cross. You know, I was about to say, oh no, I, my axe broke. Then I remembered we got a bunch of iron from that uh, and uh, also, buried treasure. And also I brought 36 iron just in case. 
Well, that ruins the moment, doesn't it? Just a bit. But yeah, I kind of I, I expected we'd at least run out of one axe. So I brought a bunch of iron just in case we ended up absolutely deforestation. <laughs> like, event of the entire landscape, just destroying everything. Um, but yes, I've been, speaking of synergies, I've been trying to flesh out the synergies page on the wiki for the current version of the mod. Hmm. It's tedious. I can imagine, but it's very helpful. Like I said, I am, I am not guaranteed doing this because last time I said I was guaranteed doing a video and didn't end up doing it, it was not good. So I'm not guaranteeing I'm doing this, but I, I am fairly set on, on, at least at some point in the future, making it's some you YouTube, yeah, exactly. Making some YouTube shorts that cover mods. Like I want to do them as YouTube shorts because for one- Because it abuses the algorithm. Yeah, for one, for one, they're easily digestible. For two, I Total, can edit them to a longer video. You're, don't pretend but, you're doing this for the viewer. Just, but, just admit that you're doing I, it for I, the algorithm. I, I said it in my video. It is fully because there is currently a very, very broken, abusive way in the algorithm which apparently mainly is only if people are only uploading shorts so it won't help that much but i'm kind of thinking for one it'll open my youtube channel to a broader audience but also it'll open modding to a broader audience which i think yeah, is something gungeon desperately become the, the chemicat gaming of yeah modern gungeon well that, that's kind of modern what, modded that's kind of what gave me the idea because Chemicat's videos are great and he's been doing like just absolutely killing it with us recently. Like he 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 went from zero subs to 10k in the amount of time it took me to get like 300. <laughs> it's insane. He, like, but then again, his videos take a lot more time than a single one of mine do. Um, and he does a lot of research into synergies and even he has videos where he goes into cross mod pack synergies, which are really interesting. Um, because obviously yeah, I do Isaac's synergies it... are a lot more soft. I just find it interesting, though, that in that he sort of has, he's like developed a decent community, he, he's doing good, but he also hasn't really got a, a personality. Yeah, because it's just like, with his channel. yeah, exactly, because it's it, like, his personality is his blue avatar, and that's it. It's, it's entirely documentarian. Yeah, like, uh, in it's, nature, it's, it's, it's very which different. Is fine. Which, That's perfectly yeah. fine, but it's very different to what, it's like... Ve it's very hard to compare that content to mine, because, yes, pe people are watching um, watching my channel, um, and most people that are staying are staying short-term because they like the game I'm playing and they're, they're learning something, or the mod pack I'm playing, but mostly long-term because of me and what I'm saying. And that obviously isn't yeah, the case you know, with Kemi Kemi game. Come for exactly. the game, stay for the weird British man. Exactly, exactly. But Kemi Cat, it's just like, here's the information. And he does the information incredibly well, but you know what you're getting, and that's that's all you get. It's it's very different, it's very hard to compare. Yeah, yeah. Um but as um as as uh, a certain someone on on my Discord would say, and this uh, is and just I just want to clarify because I realize this can be easily misunderstood. I'm not saying that Chemicat himself has no personality. I'm just <laughs> yeah. saying that he doesn't inject that personality into his videos. Of course, I don't yeah. even actually I don't even know if Chemicat is a man or a woman. Neither do I. Yeah, I'm not sure. One thing I do know, Chemicat is amazing. As a person, like Chemicat, when when he first he slash she first started out, um, was really supportive with my content and like was was sharing it on their on their socials and stuff like that. And they'd been like they, they were commenting on videos and stuff like that. They oh, you really know supportive. Chemicat? Yeah, yeah. Nice. Yeah, I've, I've seen say, them around like uh, outside of the YouTube sphere, but I, I've never really. I mainly got in contact with Chemicat through Ipecax, uh Discord because he's very active in there. He, yeah, I figured a lot, of, a lot of the item suggestions and stuff come from him. Or her, do I say? I'm assuming it's a him, but I don't know why. Uh, but anyways, um, what I was gonna say is, as someone on my uh, on my Discord would say, who shall not be named, my content is dog shit and a blatant copy of Retromations, and I have no personality, and my videos are too long and uninteresting, so I should just stop. Yeah, I mean, you're not supposed to just say it. You know. Like, everyone's thinking it. That, that, that one, pause one, as you actually feel that hurting you. I'm one sorry. One person is too, is too bold. It, it's just 
so bold and so brave to say it. Come out, come out with it. Actual facts. <laughs> yes, yes. I just, I found that, I, I, I found that quite funny. Honestly, I really did. Y yeah. I'm not going to go into depth with it too much because in, I'm, I'm not. Well, it, 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 from my perspective, you don't sound like a man who's laughing. I. It's. Ah! <laughs> it's not something that's nice to hear, but at the I same time. I thought this ravine I... would be deeper. <laughs> that's why I screamed. It's not something that's nice to hear, but at the same time, I don't actually care. Like. I, I more just think it's something that, like. I just, I thought it was such blank and like, and really kind of crappy criticism, like as in like it wasn't really criticism, it's just someone trying to offend me. And I, I just found it funny. Something just occurred to me. What's that? What if we're not seeing any mobs because they're like being filled up at the spawn chunks? Hmm, possibly, yeah. Like, I don't know if mobs even can spawn at the spawn chunks, but, like... It's night time. We might have to, we, yeah, we might have to look into that, because if mobs can spawn at the spawn chunks, it's possible they're spawning in some deep underground cave at the spawn chunks and... Uh, Stopping spawning you know. anywhere else and causing lag, which could definitely be a problem in the nether. Yeah, yeah. So that might be something we look into. Anyways, what we're we talking about? Me being salty slash laughing at people being mean to me. Oh yeah, you you being a terrible YouTuber with no value. Yes. Yeah. See, I'm allowed to say that me, because me being, uh, me being a blatant copy of Retromation. I have a license to abuse you. <laughs> license to abuse. Oh no, that just stay in your. Yeah. <laughs> stay in your lane, peasant. <laughs> Only I have a license to make fun of him. <laughs> By the way, your uh, comments are full of bots. Oh, I know. I don't understand it. It's crazy. I have to, like, go and hide the users and delete the comments every few days. But they just keep coming back. But then again, I have, ch I have checked on, like, other people's channels, like s channels that are similar to mine, like Northern Lions and Retromations when videos first come out and they get them as well. It's not just me. Yeah, I'm, I'm not even sure what the like the purpose of the bot is. Like, no, it's very uh, strange. It's like a random, random string of letters and then a timestamp and that's it. Yeah, like, I guess the timestamp is meant to, like, trick dumbasses into thinking that it's interacting with the video. Yeah, I think, I think it also... Ah! I think it also legitimizes the comment in the eyes of the YouTube spam filter. Yeah, that could make sense. Like, you I, know, I, YouTube filters aren't exactly good. Exactly. I, I think I think it kind of tricks the spam filter by thinking they're actually interacting with the video. But from what I've heard, from what I've heard about them, or like bots similar to that, not these ones specifically, but ones similar to that, um, if you if you click on the comment, if you reply to it, or you click on the, the the account, they can get access to your account. I don't know how it works. It seems pretty insane and very smart. But yeah, apparently, if you interact with the comment, they can uh, they can hack your account. I I don't know if that would be possible with like just replying to it. I watched a video about it. It was pretty in it was pretty in depth, and I don't know if that's the that's the one because it wasn't the same comment. But the fact that the comment in doesn't include any other link or any other sort of spam or scam, it makes me think that it's involved with that. But it does include a link, though. I've seen it. Some of them do, not all of them, though. Hmm. Maybe some... Maybe the person coding the bot fucked up. Possibly. Anyways, yes, I... You know, the, the worst part about them, too, is that they're just not even funny. Wait, me? Like, <laughs> you and the bot. The worst part about him is he's just not even funny. Oh, sorry, I forgot we we're doing a video. No, the worst part about the bots is that they're not even funny. Like, it's not like those weird... Yeah, like, it's it's not like the bots, bots where you kind of... Yeah, where you, where you kind of... You do have a little bit of a chuckle when you see it, because it's like... 
I'm I'm horny. Can I milk shove, me or something weird I like that. I shove eggs up my ass. <laughs> click on my photo. Yeah, come tug on my boobies. Come on, like them sort of ones. <laughs> somebody so make funny. a sound. Somebody make a sound clip of that. I want to be able to post uh, turtle saying that whenever I want. <laughs> Add that one to the turtle melon soundboard. <laughs> I'm sure someone out there's got one of those. But yeah, at least with those like, at least with those like, thirst bots, it's like, um, I'm so lonely. It's like a oh, good, yeah, good, <laughs> suffer. Yeah, you can at least, you can at least feel like you're like, haha, I got my revenge by <laughs> thinking, yes, you should be. Whereas with them, it's just like, oh, delete it, no fun. Let's go explore. Let's yeah. go run about a bit. Yeah, sure. I've got a lot of wood. <laughs> <laughs> Do you now? <laughs> yes. I also mined a lot of trees. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> I just didn't jump. I, I, I survived. I survived that with half a heart. <laughs> If I hadn't landed on this block, I'd have fucking died. <laughs> you fucking idiot! That was kind of hilarious. Oh my god. That was so close. And we're so far away as well, I would have hated to have to run all the way back here. You fucking idiot! Oh, that was kind of funny. <laughs> and like, yeah, the fact that I survived that with half a heart is scary. <laughs> My god. <laughs> this is why I don't follow you, because I just can't execute simple tasks like pressing the space bar in time. My brain's like, oh my god, it's scary. Therefore, I should just give up. <laughs> Lay down and die. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this looks like a flower forest. Ooh, pretty. Yeah, I don't, I don't see these very often. I'm um, gonna say, I, I was watching a video recently about like different occurrences in Minecraft and how rare they are, and um, I never realized how many rare biomes there are. No, yeah, there's a lot. Like, I, I kind of thought it was all kind of just flat biomes, and like they, they just the the they are as they are, and they're just all they all have a weight of one, just an even chance of showing up. I never realized there was like a ton of different really rare ones. Transitional biomes, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, um. Okay, I need to look up how uh, bees work. Beehive. Do you um, want to know the birds and the bees? Just the bees. Yes, teach me about sex. Um. <laughs> okay. Uh, da -da 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 -da. This is a pretty cool biome. I like it. Okay, it looks like bees. You grab bee, a stinger bee, bee, bee. and you shove it right up your ass. Uh, go to horny jail. Um. Um. Okay, I'm looking into it. Looks like. Uh, I think you can use campfires. To what? Yeah. To do, do what? What did you... Dickhead. Um, <laughs> you can use campfires to break hives without making bees angry. Oh, okay. Because, like, smoke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's kind of cool. Uh, what What's do we need for campfire? What do we need beehives for? Just honey. Well, we, we can... We can like make honey, and that's cool. And I want to do that. Yeah, like having an underground fucking oh, out. Um, underground hive would be really cool. Yeah, yeah. We need. What do we need? We need. What do we need, boys? We need like a piece of charcoal. So I have to make a furnace. Um. Okay. I have coal already if you need coal. Or does it have to be charcoal? Oh, give me coal. I didn't realize you had charcoal. 
Uh, you could hold the leather tunic. I think I remember the crafting recipe, maybe? For a leather tunic. Ah, oh, yeah! I remember the crafting recipe for a campfire. Worship me. <laughs> okay. So now, well, we should probably grab multiple campfires, actually. Because... Ideally, we want to get more than one hive. And there's a lot in flower forests. I gotta say, there's quite a few. I'm spying them out with my spyglass. Uh, th this game needs pinging. I need contextual pings. I need to be able to ping one out to you, because I, I can see one from a distance. And I don't want to describe it. I remember it. seeing a bunch as we came up the hill. Okay, so we put the campfire directly underneath the hive. And then we break it. It didn't work! It didn't work! Are the bees angry? Did they fix yes. that? Did they fix that in the snapshot, maybe? It's not a bug! Why would they fix it? How close to death are you? Um not not at all. Bees oh, okay. do no damage. They just poison you. Okay, uh Oh, there's more bees coming. <laughs> there's one like flying at you right now. Careful. Oh, no, I, uh, shit, I misread it, I misread it! Misread what? Shit, no, he, he became neutral, like, the moment before I hit him, and then ah. I hit him, and he, unneutral. It's not breaking the fucking hive, it's... Breaking the fucking fire. <laughs> no, placing smoke underneath the hive allows you to harvest from it without damage. Ah. Uh. <laughs> not break the hive. Oh, okay. Oh, it's fucking Alpaca Man. Yeah, uh, kill him and take his stuff. He has packed ice and sea cube, sea pickles. I want a sea pickle. Um, fucking just spit at me, you dick shit. Just fuck you. Uh, you said you have shears. I do. Uh, you need shears to oh. harvest beehives. Fucking Al. Pack your mum in in a minute, you stupid big fucking yeah, uh, lanky horse. Now, this, now that this hive is smoked up, you can go right click on it with shears to get the honeycomb. I got nothing of such. Really? Oh, uh, wait, it's because I didn't shift click. Uh, no, no, that's not working. One second. You take them. I can't do it. Okay. What? Okay. Uh, a full beehive. I could have sworn that this was a full beehive because of the bloody you particles. Dropped your, you that dropped that your sword, by the way. I know I dropped the sword. Look at this I bee see a bee this is a honeycomb. Oh, I see one. It dropped awkwardly. Okay. Look at the stoned bee. <clears throat> he's oh, absolutely he's gonna... cracked out. Later, boy. Okay. So, once we get enough honeycomb, we can um, start trying to lure bees back to our base, and we honeycomb have, is what we... We do have some bees near our, near the entrance to our base, so we can do that at home. We don't have to do it all yeah, we over here. We need, we need flowers to draw the bees in, and once we've drawn them in, we can use the honeycomb to make a hive for them. Do we have enough honeycomb already? Uh, we have enough for one hive. Okay, that's, that's good enough. Yeah, if we see any other hives, I've got the campfires for it. But yeah, that was a. I think that's a good investment. Yeah, definitely. I gonna say I've not really messed with the bees since they came out, so it's kind of cool, cool to actually do something with them. And they've been out a while. Yeah, you know, we're being clever boys. Come get your. Sword I still back before feel we leave. stupid. I don't need the sword. I use an axe. And it was almost sword. broken, anyways. Damn it, was You're right. Where about I? Um. Uh, everywhere at the end of time. Okay. I'll meet you back at the little sandcastle I made. Oh, there you are, I see. Yes. Let's carry Let's on. Back. Oh, we're heading back, okay. Oh, heading back? I don't, I don't know what we're doing. Let's carry on. I really want to find a village. I think we should, I think we should make the, the time investment to find one. Because the thing is, if we, if we're like really close to one now and stop and go back, I'm going to be sad. I mean, I know that we won't actually know, but... 
I'd rather just like push forward. We've got plenty of time. Um, keep your eyes out for a hive. I will do. Because the more hives we can get, the better. Like we don't need honey, but it's like nice I want have, honey. It? Yeah, I I, th I think even though it's not necessary, uh, a hive room would be really fun. I think we should do try and do as many weirdly themed rooms down there as possible, and make it look like a natural cave, but very unnatural. <laughs> we could even hang like uh, artificial, like we we'll make a thing, but we won't make it a room. We'll just make it like an open like hanging thing where are you i'm behind you now i i i saw that you were getting lost so i stopped oh thank you no worries let's keep on like going. if we make it if we make an open platform and put the hives on it then yeah. the bees will sort of just permeate throughout the cave yeah oh it's gonna be so cool if you can see if you like use your spyglass and you can see the bees like really high up like just flying through that massive ceiling in the cave all we'll need is to like make little flower gardens around the cave and the bees will that's travel so back cool. and forth from the flowers that's gonna be so cool this game's so wholesome yeah it is let me kill this cow <laughs> let me just murder this living being yeah exactly it's a little it's a little upsetting that because of the server taking a while to load in chunks, the spyglass is kind of useless for searching ahead because the, the chunk isn't there yet. Ah, uh, flower fields. Yeah, like, there's a lot of rare transitional biomes in the game. Yeah, I didn't know about a lot of them until very recently. It's like, uh, hills that are slightly less extreme than the extreme hills, but they're also kind of extreme and uh, they're snowy. Yeah, I know that and, the and I know that the, the rarest one is like a a transitional hills um jungle biome, I think it's called something like that. It's it's a very specific one, but that one's like the rarest biome. It has like a zero point zero 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 six three percent chance of spawning in each world or something, or like each chunk you load or whatever, each biome you go to. It's really Yeah, rare. people are all about mushroom biomes. Psh, mushroom say, biomes, mushroom, damn it, damn. Mushrooms are like nowhere near as rare. It's just because the thing is, a lot of people might have even seen one, but just never known, because they're not that much different to jungle biomes. They look a little more like hill biomes, just with the jungle trees and textures. Yeah, though, I, I will say, finding those rare biomes feels good, like... Yeah, it does. Um, I, I love frozen, finding rare events and stuff like that. Frozen in Ocean. I gotta say, coming coming across like random rare events and stuff in games is really fun. Even if it's meaningless. Yeah. Like like recently, I was playing. Uh, I say recently, when I like a good like few months ago now. Oh, beehive. Um, oh, uh, beehive. Yeah, beehive. Uh, if you just come up here, uh, I was playing Nuclear Throne Territorial Expansion, and if you go to the the seaside area, there's a really rare chance that a massive fucking crocodile swim by. And it's just like a visual thing, but it's super rare. And it was so cool to see it. It scared oh. the shit out of me when I saw it. Uh, I didn't... I, I made a mistake. You can only do it on full beehives. This ah. beehive isn't full. I did not know that. What's the difference? What do they look like? Uh, they look like they have honey spewing out of them, and they ah, okay. drip like little honey particles. Okie dokie. I see some horses over there. I mean, speaking of uh, weird biomes, sunflower plains. Yeah, kind of nice. We'll find some we should, cool ones. We should probably grab a couple of these sunflowers just in case, because we can. Uh, you can There's reproduce so sunflowers infinitely once you have like one. So if we ever want sunflowers, we just grab a few here. And, we got and another, now let's we got kill the flowery animals. hills. There's more flowery hills here. Look. Uh, unless we just did a big circle. Oh, uh, possibly, yeah, you're right. <laughs> oh, look, it's a single zombie. He's doing his best, okay? Where did you just go? I've lost you again. Oh, there you are. Ashley, Ashley. I've, I've lost, I lost myself a long time ago. Who's yourself, fool? Music make you look and roll. Music make you look and roll. Music make you look and roll. <laughs> but this, this sort of thing is like my favorite thing to do, like when you're playing co-op Minecraft. It's just 
just to like run around and find shit. It's just, that, that's another reason why the caves update is so great because it makes doing that so much more fun. Just trying to get all of the diamonds you need just off of surface level ones in caves. Yeah, it's gonna take a fuck ton longer, but it's way more interesting because you could find mine shafts, geodes, all sorts of cool stuff. Ow. Ah, oh, damn it. You survived. Um, Let's keep on going. You have an arrow in your foot. Not the neither. Not one of mine. That's I used me. to be an adventurer like you until some asshole jammed an arrow in my foot. <laughs> in my Achilles tendon. Ooh, that does not sound nice. Oh my god, that sounds terrible. The foot, that's fine. But the tendon. Ugh. I'm gonna mm. grab you by the leg, cut you open, and use your Achilles tendon <laughs> to fire arrows. Oh my god. I'm looking forward to meeting you in person. Yeah, it'll be great. You'll <laughs> never be heard from again. I wonder how many people think I'm actually a serial killer. I wonder how many people know. <laughs> <laughs> Well, not, not many of them, because they're all dead, but still. Yeah, yeah, what I'm really asking is, I wonder how many people I need to kill. <laughs> YouTube killer. He uses the YouTube algorithm to find his victims. Yes. <laughs> Police We're talking about he's people... unreliable. <laughs> he uses the YouTube algorithm to find his victims. Children's channels disappear overnight. <laughs> wow, the juice found dead. Those satisfying videos channels that just spam out satisfying videos. <laughs> well, I gotta all say, just gone. They, they, they get like 30 videos and they spam them out like 80,000 times. Yeah. 16 super satisfying things. In a different order than last time, but the same videos. Yeah. <laughs> it's so satisfying, we think you want to see it again. And then kids are like, Holy fuck, this is amazing content. My god. My mind is blown. <laughs> Children are so dumb. I know. We should just destroy them. Yeah, that'd be easy. We're going to have to end this episode in the middle of the wilderness, and the yeah. next episode's just going to be going back. I know, but the thing is, if, as long as we take a different path back, we can probably find something cool. I'm gonna grab some snow here, actually. Okay. Uh, I just don't have a lot of inventory space. I should have made a bundle. Yeah, we need rabbits, uh, rabbits thing. That's actually been another thing that I've had my eye out for, um, is the materials to make a bundle, but we need rabbit, um, hide. Yeah. But yeah, if we grab snow, we can make an infinite snow farm back home. Yes, we can. Right. Good idea. I still don't like how snowballs are bloody limited. Okay, I have four snow blocks. That's plenty. Now, where have you gone? I'm just killing a skeleton just next to you. Yeah, he landed on me. It hurt a lot. I'm scaling this bit here. Let's just go up through here, I think. Up on you board. Mean... Oh, you've gone round. And I guarantee it's going to be faster. You're faster. Yeah, I'm a fast as fuck, boy. boy. This is another really cool area, though. Yeah, I gotta say, we're finding some just absolutely amazing locations. Like, this could go in a bloody uh, Minecraft satisfying moments compilation. It definitely could. We should make them. That's, that's, that's what we, we're both gonna convert our channels to satisfying moments channels. Okay, I grabbed a pumpkin. Pumpkin. Pump. Now we can make the golem. We would like. Pump. Pump. And we can get the pumpkin back too. Yeah. And you know we, I was like we can, oh, we're gonna make seeds and we're gonna make a golem, but we can do both. I don't know why that didn't. I didn't realize that. We could just chop its head off and we're done with him. But like, you can. I, I completely forgot that in like latest later updates when they made like I 
I'm the first man to climb the mountain. There you go, I see. I'm from New Zealand, it's in my blood. Gotta climb those tings. Don't ever say that again. I will. This is sheer. Oops, that's not mm -hmm. what I meant to do. <laughs> I, I will make a monument I my greatness. To, I tried to look through my little uh, fucking telescope and I was looking too close to the ground while holding blocks and it was just like, spam. Um, I want to find a snow village. I've never found a snow village before. I seem to always find desert villages. They seem to be the most common. I mean, deserts are big, wide-open plains that are typically pretty large biomes. Yeah, usually. Quite easy to see stuff. Yeah, you're right. Oh, by the way, while we're on these areas here, look out for emeralds. I found a few surface-level emeralds while I was in areas like this recently. I'll find a village. We won't need to worry about it. Oh, I know, I know, but we might as well pick them up. It would be nice, that, if they made emeralds a little more useful, the actual ore of emeralds, especially with the mountains coming in. We have made emerald ore more useful by nerfing villagers. <laughs> Not quite like that. Gather leather if you can as well, because we're going to oh, need... Oh, yeah, going to uh, need books. You're right. I kind of forgot about that. Kind of a requirement. Oh, it's a turtle! Don't kill it, please. He's my child. Hmm. If only we had silk touch, we should steal its eggs. <gasps> we should make... If we steal turtle eggs, we can try and make an underground turtle, like... Oh, yeah, a little turtle sanctuary. Place. Yeah, because I, I think we can do that. I th okay, let me just look up... Uh... I, I need I, to I'm, figure out... While, while you're doing that, I'm just going to box myself in somewhere, and I'll be right back, and I'm, I'm, I'm going to be, like, two seconds. Be right back. I am back. What was it you're finding out? I was just looking if we can, like, make new home beaches for the turtles. And yeah, we can. Nice. So the way turtles work in Minecraft is they return to the area they hatched um, when they want to lay eggs. Okay. So as long as we hatch them where we want them to stay, they'll stay there. Yeah. So if we, if we get silk touch and find two turtles... We can start an underground turtle beach, which I think is cool. Me too. I think that sounds great. What, what you making? I was going to make birds, but I can't remember how to do that. I accidentally threw all of my how food. How do you make birds? It's a... Make a minecart out of wood. How do you make a minecart? U-shape! Yeah, I did that. and it's, Does it not work with birch planks? I swear, when I see the recording and I figure out you're trying to craft a wooden bucket or something, I'm going to be very mad. Oh, well, th th this time it worked. Okay, I did the exact same recipe before. Come on now, game. Don't lie to me here. Here's a boat for you, my boy. Why don't we just ride in the same boat? Oh, yeah, we can. Get in, bitch. We're going shopping. <laughs> this is great. You're like a little pirate with your spyglass. da 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 I'm having to slow oh, down because I'm, I'm waiting for chunks to load. <laughs> Are we going the I'm right way? I'm keep my eye on the undersea terrain to see if we can spot something. Okay, good idea. Yes, we are going the right way. Kind of. Um, wait, no. Head this. 
Okay. Whatever you say, boss. We're heading the right way now. We on the path. Okay, yeah, sure. Sure we are. We do be zooming. Next episode will actually be some building now that we have a lot of materials, though. Hell yeah. I have everything I need. I, I, except, I literally you know. have to keep stopping because just chunks just, just do not load. It's kind of frustrating, but... Move faster! Come on, world. Generate a little faster. You can do it. Keep chugging. You know, the worst part about boats is that they um, specifically made it so that you can't attack the captain. Ah, what's happened to our boat? It's wobbling. Just keep uh, going. Why is it wobbling? I'm scared. Um, just keep going. I see a lot of drowned. I can't keep going. I do see a lot of drowned as well. Holy fuck. Maybe this is where all the mobs were the whole time. This is going to take forever to get across. The thing is, I can't, like, I'd love to just keep going, but if I go into the unloaded chunk, it just kind of glitches me out. Just go. Move it. Balls to the wall. Pedal to the metal. For some reason, the uh, the pop-up left shift to dismount keeps on showing up, like, over and over again, and I think it's trying to tell me something. <laughs> Get off this dangerous fucking ride. What are you- why are you doing figure eights? Because I'm waiting for the fucking chunks to load. <laughs> they are loaded! They're not for me. I don't know what's going on with my game, but they are not for me. All of the ones in front- like, literally, every the chunk boat's in front of me- again. What did you do? I don't know. I don't think this boat was made for two people. Doesn't seem like it. I kinda want you to drive if your chunks are loading and mine aren't. <laughs> How do I get out? No, just just drive. I don't even know if we're going the right way, so let me check. Okay, we are. Good. Yeah, thank goodness. Stop wobbling, Bert. It's making me nervous. This is just what boats do. You've never been in a boat before? Not quite this vigorously, though. Ah... Uh... The ocean. A beautiful place. Come on now. I've, I've reached the border. It just won't load anymore now. I'm stuck. I'm trying to left shift to dismount, game. Help! I'm stuck in a boat with this madman! <laughs> Why is the, the game's just completely stuck? It just cannot load these chunks. I don't get it. Wait, is that a structure? I want out. I want off Mr. Bones Wild Ride. The boat is just broken. This is it. This Can is the Can you get out? Nope. I don't, I don't, unless I'm pressing the wrong button. What's the button to get out? I'm shifting in the boat. Yeah, I'm shifting in the boat too. Something's wrong. <laughs> Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna wrong. I'm gonna relog. Yeah, me too. Um, right, I'm back. Now my name is back too. Right, you you, uh, you you drive. You drive. How do I get in? How do I get in? You've left without what? me, dude. You've left without me. Get in the boat. Is it right click? Yes, it yes. is. Cool. Right. Okay. Uh, we're heading um, towards we're, we're heading? heading towards plus four hundred plus four hundred. Okay, well then this is the wrong direction. Is it? Oh, there's land. I just saw land. Okay, we're heading to this, plus this 400. Is right. This is right. Okay. Now we zoom in, boys. See? It's not that big of a deal. Ah! <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> okay, yeah, we're not going over the choke borders anymore. <laughs> Immediately goes into unloaded chunk and fucking dies. It's very, it's very scary. <laughs> when Epilepsy you just go over warning. and it's like, oh! Your guy starts vibrating <laughs> rapidly. Epilepsy warning. I've screamed a lot this episode. <laughs> oh my god. 
look at the sky. How very beautiful! Just <laughs> uh, say hey! What a wonderful candidate! Oh no, not again! I didn't mean to! I swear! <laughs> There's five moons! I see five moons! Oh my god. Beep. I can spyglass up the moon though. Beep beep. Uh, yeah, yeah, I don't feel so good. Yeah, this is. So you think uh, this chunk's heavy to load? This one doesn't want to load, does it? I'm seeing circles, Mr. Krabs! We out at sea, boys. Yeah, I can. I'm, I'm relocking again. I can't take it anymore. You went very quiet. Yeah, I gotta say it's cool. It's cool. I'm, I I I didn't have to relog. My game's like kind of solid. Am I am I the weakest link here? Maybe. I'm still able to left shift to dis. Okay, there you go. I dismounted the boat. Relogging seems to help drastically. <laughs> it's a beautiful, beautiful night. Get in. I'm in. We still pointed the right direction? Uh, I think so. Go forward. Um, not quite. No. Just open your F3 menu, please. I am. Going a direction till both of the numbers go down. That's what I'm trying <laughs> to do. You're bad at it. I'm you... going one. I'm going for no, one it's... because I can't seem to figure out both. Wait, you're not going for either at the minute. Oh wait, F shit. <laughs> you're I not mean, going for either. Okay, you're. G Why? It's going up when I go this way, <laughs> but it's going up when I go this way too. <laughs> What is going on? I'm taking a dolphin. I don't care. I'm taking a dolphin. Me and this dolphin, we're going on great adventures. I don't care. I'm leaving. I'm leaving and I'm taking the kids. I wanted the dolphin. I'm stranded. All alone. I, do I don't understand. Coordinates no worky. I think it might have just been because we were in a boat, because now the chunks are loading fine. Yeah, it's probably just too quick for the game. Oh, no, I just fell out of the world. <laughs> I found the right direction. Um, are you, like, fully gone? I knew me, but now my dolphin is gone. I found three dolphins that are stuck in stasis. Why? stasis. Oh, I just fucking used an enderpearl by accident. Whoopsie. Genius. Oh, and the bird's gone. What? How the fuck? <laughs> How the fuck did you get over there, Bert? I don't know, maybe you teleported. No, but I, th I threw it straight down. <laughs> the way that I teleported didn't make any sense. Holy shit, I found some dolphins. Yeah, my dolphin is gone. I have four. Well, whoopty friggin' do. Isn't that good for you? Ah, I hit Minecraft. Never playing Minecraft again. No more Minecraft. <laughs> I love the dolphin speed. It's so cool. Yeah, it's faster than boats. Yeah, it's crazy. It's great. But sometimes they dislatch. Come on, fella. You're mine now. Be my slave. And sometimes they vanish without a trace. Hey, I found turtles! Fucking dolphin! Latch onto my ass! <laughs> I found turtles. If this fucking big fish doesn't suction cup itself to my butt, I'm gonna be sad. It's not, it's not how dolphins work. I think you're thinking of lampreys. Not the sort of dolphins you know. Okay, what sort of weird sexual metaphor is this that I'm not getting? 
I've heard a lot of, I, I know a lot of sexual metaphors. I've, I've never heard of dolphin before. Nah, that's just when you fucking actually a dolphin. Uh, Where it's laying in the sea. Uh, <laughs> uh, you have reminded me of the guy who wrote a book about that. Oh no. Oh no. Did you hey, hear about that? I'm on land. I'm back so to the I. island. Wait, do you see you saw turtles when you when you got to the beach? Because if so, we we'll probably yeah. we we'll probably entered the same beach. Yeah, there are two I turtles. See, I see turtles too. I see turtles are green. I recognize where we are. This is where I got all the kelp, I think. Oh, finally. This was the worst. I think I just found that. Uh, is this a similar lake? No, I think this is a different lake. What's your Y coordinates and your X coordinates and your uh, coordinates? Y coordinate is 69. Nice. What about your X and Z? X, uh, 160. Okay, this isn't me making a joke. My X is 169. Um, my Z is 150. Okay, so you're quite far inland by now then. Yes. Okay, that's cool. I'm heading the right way now, so I should catch up with you never, but I will see you soon. Yeah. I see sheep. We did a nice amount of deforesting today. Sheep are white, brown cows too. I see them die, and I see them moo. <laughs> and I think to myself, what a wonderful world. I really hope there's someone listening at your door. And they're going to be like, what the oh, no, they can all hear me. They can all hear me. I know they can hear me. And I know they're concerned. <laughs> oh my god. They're going to be like, why did we pick this one? And we send it back. I want a different child. <laughs> did someone actually say something in the background then? Um, yes, because they don't understand that I'm the only one who's allowed to be yelling. Do they not understand that you're an important YouTuber? I am a YouTube phenomenon. I found my way back to the old annex. Hey, nice. That's kind of where I normally just enter from, and because it's kind of hard to find from there to the, to the new entrance. So I just go straight in there and then run across. Hey, I found that. I, found, I just, as I'm saying that, I found the new entrance. <laughs> Alright, well, I'll just head down via the annex and we'll meet. Uh, where will we meet? Normal best. That's where I'm going to end up. I still can't find my way to the staircase. Okay, if I'm over to the old staircase, I'm on the new one. I think for myself. What a wonderful See, you don't get DMC out if you just sing like shit. I could while away the hours, confirming with the flowers, consulting with the rain. And my head, I'd be scratching while my thoughts were busy hatching if what I only had a brain. Ah, motherfucking bastard. I'm sorry, okay? <laughs> I didn't mean it. There's a chest here that you've just, I, I specifically made for putting wood in, and you've just lobbed all sorts of weird shit in there. Stuff that there's other stacks of in another chest. We haven't even built a storage room yet, it's fine. Also, this is rich coming from you. <sighs> The way you do things frustrates me. <laughs> yeah, me too. I'll be coming round the mountain when they go. Oh no. Oh no. I may have done a Hello. bad. I may have done a real what? bad. What did you do? I've dropped out wood on the floor and it no longer will pick up. Uh... It's stuck. 
Don't worry, turtle. I have massive wood. I'd like so many stacks. Look, it's just here and it just won't pick up anymore. <laughs> Dumb ass. Oh, wait, some of it picks up. It's trying. Gotta stand here long enough. There we go. It's it's sorted itself. I do like, like I'm putting it all in the wood chest because we don't even have a like a proper place for it yet. Okay, so I, I say we leave it here because yep. um pain. I think so too. Uh the, the server's clearly having issues anyway, so Yes. Uh, it, it made for a funny fun video. Fun video. Funny video. <laughs> Yeah, well, I think I think next episode I'll I'll m expand this storage. I won't make the full storage system, of course, but I'll at least expand that storage and make it more organized. Um, and uh, and I'll build the bubble <sighs> as, as well. No, well, yeah, well, we'll do that. We'll check the Nether, and in the meantime, I'll like try to flesh out a few of the pathways. Yeah. Okay. Um, actually, I might end up I might end up doing the bubble elevators off camera because it's kind of dull. But we'll 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 get to that either way. Hope you guys <laughs> enjoyed this one. This was fun. Uh, of course, lots of randomness, but we just hit two hours, exactly, so hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye!